Well, hi everyone. I'm local five chief meteorologist Brad Edwards in the weather lab talking about why do bridges sometimes freeze first and that you sometimes have run into that scenario and sometimes there's even a sign place there to watch out for ice on bridges. Well, let's talk about it. Kind of a nifty graphic here and you see temperatures are both at 35 degrees in this particular scenario and most roads do lose their heat evenly. So you're driving down the road. Everything's the same. Everything's 35 degrees, but then things can change because what happens is you start to see this wind blowing and cold air can be of course above and below the bridges as that cold air basically moves above and below the bridge. It basically changes that bridge into whatever the air temperature is. So a lot of times the air temperature can drop pretty quickly at night and then the road temperature takes longer to drop. So you start to see where the road is uh, basically at 33 degrees and the bridge temperature could be 32 degrees or colder and then you start to see the ice forming on top of that. So it can be very, very dangerous out there. And this can also apply to sometimes when we're measuring snowfall because you have to measure snowfall where it's not melting. And sometimes the ground temperatures are actually warmer and it is melting some of that snow from the bottom up. So be careful on those bridges, especially when you have colder air blowing at that time. That's your latest weather lab. Thanks for watching.